to the vlog channel, guys. We have another <laughs> lit vlog for you guys. As you guys see by the title, today I'm getting my first tattoo. Everyone says the pain hurts, it doesn't hurt. So I today, don't think it's gonna hurt that bad. Listen, today I'll be letting you guys know exactly how feeling this tattoo. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, because look, I'm getting some shadings, like a couple of shadings on, mm -hmm. and it's gonna be like a low kind of medium sized tattoo on my wrist. Mm -hmm. So comment down below if you guys have ever gotten a tattoo before in your experience, like did it hurt or did it not? Yeah, I feel like it also depends on the area because like I have this tattoo that has Cameron's initial in it. I don't know if you guys can see, but I have this tattoo and this one didn't hurt that bad. It took about like two hours or so and it didn't hurt that bad. And then I also have one on my ankle which that one was my first one. And it wasn't bad, it was like 10 minutes long. It wasn't really that bad. But I think that you're gonna be okay because you have a very high pain tolerance. Yeah guys, I'm hoping I'm gonna be okay. Cause you look, are. I don't wanna be looking like a little baby in there, like fidgeting, like, no, one, okay. you, hey, you guys know like when little kids get a haircut for the first time, like they're crying, moving <laughs> around and everything, and you need to like feed them some candy just so mm -hmm. they can sit still. I don't want to be like one of those people getting tattooed. But first of all, he was bugging at the beginning because this man wanted his first tattoo to be half asleep. I'm like, babe, you got to start with something smaller because yeah, you don't I know don't know your the pain, pain tolerance. I really don't, so. Yeah, so today, this is like very last minute too. He literally booked his appointment yesterday and the yeah. girl had a cancellation, I think. She had a cancellation for today. Like yeah. there's an appointment today and there's a cancellation. So I kind of lucked out and got in that spot. Mm -hmm. Literally like the next day booked, boom. Yeah. Now today's the day, so. We actually have to leave because my appointment's at like 1.15, so. Yeah, and we have to take the dogs to my aunt's house because they want to have a little sleep over there. They miss Coco and Chloe, so we're going to drop them off there. And then I want to treat you to some lunch afterward because it's going to be rough, okay? Oh, snap. That's what I like to hear. <laughs> I mean, is it going to be Chick-fil-A? Huh? Is it going to be Chick-fil-A? Yeah, but you have Chick-fil-A all the time. I want to take yeah. you after like a nice lunch. I need like a salad. Right. A salad? <laughs> all right, guys, we're going to hop on the road. Wait, 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 wait. Show them our outfits. All right, guys, so real quick, we're going to do ladies first. Trish has like a nice little whipped cream color little sweatsuit with the mocha ones on. Burberry shoes with a nice ripped up retro looking I like those jeans. Oh, jeans, okay. gray, they're gray. Mm -hmm. With the little LV belt on and then a shirt that Trisha does not approve. I don't know, I, okay. It's Playboy. It's a Playboy shirt, but Trisha does not approve it. Was it was the way that you bought it. Literally, we went to the mall yesterday and this kid like, he ran to like the corner, grabbed the shirt, put it on the thing, and then threw it right in the bag. I'm like, what the heck is that? And then I looked at it, and it has like, you know, models on it, whatever. And this kid's like, what? Guys, come it's on. Not like it's not even that serious. It's not that serious. It's the way that you've got it that made it like, come on. Baby. No, you guys, hey, you know how girls are when you, there's other girls in the. Right, picture. but there's like cheeks on your chest. Like, come All right, on. If there's, if there, if there's cheeks on my chest, there's cheeks on my chest. Can I go get my tattoo now? So we just dropped the dogs off. That was a whole process. And I felt like kind of like a mom. I was like sending my kids off to school. I felt kind of upset. <laughs> Did you feel like upset at all? Nah, not upset. Like I just feel a little nervous um, mm -hmm. because it's Coco. Coco's first time, no. Chloe's, Chloe's first time. Chloe's first time. We have that parent thing where we get their names mixed up sometimes. Yeah, it's, it's Chloe's first time mm -hmm. um, sleeping over with you know, my aunt and everything. Mm -hmm. um, and Coco at the same time. So like, they're both rowdy. They're both rowdy like that and they rough play like crazy. So yeah. I'm a little nervous about that and them going up the steps and stuff like mm -hmm. that, so. Typical parent stuff, but they'll be fine. We just, we just need to let the reins up. But we do have Cameron's appointment in less than 10 minutes and we might be a smidge bit late if Cameron doesn't put the pedal to the metal. Babe, we're not gonna be late. We're not gonna be late. So, um, yeah, are you excited? Any last final thoughts? Nah, I'm just gonna get in there and get my, what I gotta get done and get a bath. He's acting like a G. Like, I know you're OD excited, babe. Babe, I'm Like, you get, feel like a little giddy right now. I know you do. So I'm gonna get in and I'm gonna get out. So right now, Cam's filling out his paperwork and then she's doing, like, new sizing for the tattoo itself because it was a little Sheesh. too big. Are you excited now? Now that, like, you're in the room and stuff, are you excited? You know, it is what it is at this point. <laughs> So now he's sitting down and this is like the placement that he kind of went gonna, with. It's not gonna have like the outline like right, that. Yeah, it's yeah. gonna be the crosses. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this is like the, the 
piece that he went with. Now he's planning on getting like a sleeve eventually, so this is just kind of like the first start of it. Sheesh! <laughs> I really didn't think it was gonna be like this. Really? What does it feel like to you? Like, describe what you feel like. So I got like 10 people biting me in the same spot. <laughs> yeah. spot. You're dragging it. <laughs> Not gonna lie. It looks good so far. Yeah. I wish I had a little squishy bow. That's the only thing. Okay, so for your next tattoo, we'll order you on, okay? I need like a squishy bow. <laughs> You're Catholic. It was hurt. Yo, I know. It's my first tattoo, you know what I'm I saying? Know. So obviously everyone has don't, a first. Don't come for my baby either. Look, I was trying to be hard, guys, but mm -hmm. like, it's my first. I did not That's know okay. what to expect, and it felt like mad people just biting your arms. I know. It felt like zombies was eating me. <laughs> I am very proud of you. And if I see one person come at you, I'm gonna beat them out, okay, I don't folks? care, baby, they could roast me. I don't no. care, because I was being a little baby and they ain't no. gonna lie. I was. It doesn't matter, she it's your first time. Roast me in the comment section. No, don't come at my boy. Roast me in the comment section. Babe, no, because you know what? I'm proud of you, you did that. And guess what? Now you know what it feels like and whatever. And now you can decide when you want your next one, if you want your next one. Yo, guys, I have another one coming up, actually, the end of this month, right? Yeah, May, yeah. Yeah, the May. End of May. End of May, I have another one coming. It's gonna be like... Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, I don't know. Up here now. <laughs> Wait, I have to keep my tattoo out of the sun, right? Yes. I feel like I'm gonna die. <laughs> Just stop it. You're so dramatic. You're okay. Open wounds. Baby, stop it. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm pushing. Okay, I'm so what are you what are you in the mood for? I Wait, you why am I driving, guys? I said I would drive. You want me to drive? Yeah, drive. Okay. <laughs> guys, I'm not gonna lie. She did this O D. Quick, yo. Yo, we she were only in there for like 40 minutes. She was literally like, yo. At first, like, I didn't even like, all right, it's gonna hurt a little bit. Like, she just, boom, arm, boom. She went, bzz, bzz, bzz. yo, I was like, whoa, what is she? She went crazy, yo. She yeah. went super fast, ain't gonna hold you. But it looked that's mad good. good. Yeah, I'm, I'm excited happy. for you. Good. I'm a little scared for future tattoos, man. Like, that's some other type of pain. Mm -hmm. I got, yo, I have one at the end of this. Of next month. Mm -hmm. We're gonna figure out what we're gonna go eat and we will update you guys. All right guys, so right now we are at the mall. We finished eating lunch and everything and this girl had to come here because you know, girls always gotta go to Victoria's Secret for some reason. Listen, I, don't I know haven't why. gotten some new stuff from there in like years, so I figured, you know, it's about okay, time. Okay, 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 okay. But what did, all right, so what did you just tell me you had to go shopping with? Where? Michael Kors. No, 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 no. You said on the way out, where? Oh, Sephora. See, and I'm not shopping today, guys, <laughs> at all. Look, my tattoo is doing good. It's bleeding a lot, guys. Yeah, it is. So we gotta go home and um, clean it up. I'm yeah. just gonna take it off, though. Yeah, so we'll go home. Actually, we have to stop at like CVS or Walgreens or something so I can get you antibacterial soap. Well, how about we hurry up and get out of the mall then? Miss, I wanna shop okay, until I drop. We have to get our mom's Mother's Day gifts. I'm not getting my mom nothing right now. Okay. 
I do want to go on the Zara thing. Oh, see, yeah. see, exactly. What? See, you want to go shop now. You said that was the only reason you walk alone because you were waiting for me? Yeah. Are you sure about that? Positive. I was see? getting a little bit bored. I was like, I'm going to go spend some money real quick. <laughs> but she was spending money and it made me feel like, you know. Hey, you got a tattoo. That didn't mean that I got a tattoo today. Yeah, you was trying to get a tattoo. I know, I really was. <laughs> All right guys, so we just got home and now Cameron's taking off this thing. Are you okay? Why are you looking at me like that? Because you didn't tell me. Babe, you know. okay, I'm sorry. Put this on the water. It's gonna help, it's gonna have to help it. Anyone that has had tattoos in the past, what do you guys recommend for like Cameron's next tattoo and my future tattoos? To get the second skin thing and leave that on for three to five days or just get like the saran wrap thing and all that stuff. Cameron just wants to take this off because it's bothering him and there's a lot of blood in there. Stop bothering me. It's just, I'm, the tattoo girl, she said, push the blood out on the sides. I'm trying to push it out on the sides and it's not coming out on the sides. Yeah. So, so we're point. just going to take it off and then wash it with antibacterial soap that we just got from the store. Put some Aquaphor on it and then see how it goes. But you know what sucks is that this is like sticky plastic. It's like it's mm -hmm. sticky and it's sticking to my wound right now. Like I have to rip it off my wound. Just be careful. All right, so after we washed it, put some Aquaphor on, this is the final, final result. So honest, final thoughts, advice to people getting their first tattoo, what do you um, guys say? First tattoo, at least bring like a stressor ball, like one of the things that you squeeze. Because mm -hmm. um, especially, you don't even know what the pain is like. So for sure, um, I would definitely bring like a stress ball, just so you can squeeze, because you don't know what the pain is and then, you know, maybe you won't need the stress ball anymore after your she's almost or he's almost done with your tattoo. Towards the end, I was just like, Gina, I was just like, oh yeah, this is not, it doesn't hurt that much anymore. Mm -hmm. So I was just like, for sure, for sure, like, I didn't need, I didn't need it anymore, but it did, it did hurt more than I thought it would, so. Yeah, and I feel like different areas of your body are also different, and since like everybody's like skin is different and like their body, their pain tolerance, I feel like it's just different for literally every single person. But yeah, I think it looks super, super good. So now the next stat that's coming up is at the end of is the Is my name on your forehead? No. It's <laughs> the end of May and I'm getting a butterfly or I might switch it up, I don't know. So I think we're gonna end off this vlog right here because I think it's just a chill day for the rest of the day now. We might clean up our house a little bit. The girls aren't here and it feels very weird, honestly. This kid's feeling this up. <laughs> Anyways guys, if you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up and also subscribe to our vlog channel if you are new. And also don't forget to go head over to trishaandcammerch.com if you guys want to go cop some merch. We are having a sale right now where you get a free beanie with any purchase. So if you guys want to take advantage of that offer, make sure you go in the link in the description and go cop some. With that being said, everyone wish Cameron in the comment section to feel better, I guess. Good luck healing, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> With that being said, we'll see you guys in our next video. Peace.